What's going on, guys? It's Ryan Smetzer, and I have the honor to be able to sit down virtually with Stephanie Andriazzi with Wellspan Health here in Pennsylvania in the greater region. Stephanie, great to have you on this morning. Ryan, thanks so much for having us. Yeah, you know, so we are entering into a season where we're hearing a lot of this light at the end of the tunnel stuff. And a lot of it has to do with the fact that we now have access to a COVID-19 vaccine. And of course, we're in the process of getting the area vaccinated. But a lot of people have the big question of the how do I get it? Why do I get it? And all of those different things. So I thought we'd kind of sit down with you for a little bit and kind of weed through some of those details. And the first thing being, what is the process of getting a COVID vaccine if you are in our area? If you are currently in phase 1A of the Pennsylvania Department of Health's interim vaccination plan, and just to review for the group, that's anyone age 65 and older or those ages 16 to 64 with underlying medical conditions, we encourage you to go out to our website and enter into uh, My Wellspan. So if you have a My Wellspan account, you can log into that account, uh, select an appointment and attempt to schedule your vaccine. If you don't have a My Wellspan account, we encourage you to sign up for that account on the wellspan.org slash coronavirus uh, website. Uh, the other opportunity you have is to call our COVID hotline that number is 855-851-3641 to speak to someone about scheduling an appointment for the vaccine. Right now, vaccine appointments continue to be very limited, but as vaccine supply increases, we anticipate opening up more appointments every week to vaccinate people in central Pennsylvania. That's awesome. And, you know, that's that's exactly what people need is that, you know, hey, we got this website, we've got the hotline there. And, you know, I know there are, there are a few people like get, that get kind of frustrated by the process of going online and filling out the form. And so that's good that you guys have that that hotline option for sure. Um, now, there is a little bit of kind of a myth that needs to be squashed to of those who have already had COVID. Um, I've had friends of mine that have even said like, hey, I, you know, I already have COVID-19. Does that mean that I can go like nine to 12 months without getting the vaccine? Squash that myth for us. <laughs> sure. So what we know about natural immunity is that it is not as effective as vaccine immunity. And after about three months, individuals start to see a decline in antibodies if tested. So we are strongly recommending even those individuals who have had COVID-19 in the past to consider getting vaccinated as soon as they meet the Pennsylvania's state eligibility criteria and can get access to an appointment. The one caveat to that is if you received antibody therapy as part of your treatment for COVID-19, you do need to wait 90 days from the date of that treatment before you can be vaccinated. Gotcha. All right. Well, and you know, the, what are the best resources for people to check routinely? Because I know that something that we've learned over the last year is a lot can change very quickly over time. And, uh, you know, I think that definitely with regards to vaccine availability, that can definitely change, you know, as the demand is met and as, you know, more and more people are, are heading out to get vaccinated. Um, what's a good resource for people to check routinely to see, you know, when they're, you know, eligible for the vaccine or when they can schedule an appointment? Uh, I strongly encourage people to land on our Wellspan website, wellspan.org. Our COVID-19 page has up-to-date information about uh, the phase that the Department of Health is in, our vaccine appointment strategy, and our vaccine locations. The Department of Health website also has updated information on their phased approach to vaccinating Pennsylvanians and where vaccine may be available. Fantastic. And for those that are hesitant, um, for those that may be in um, that crowd or that category that really are kind of on the fence, I don't know if I'm going to get the vaccine when it comes out and all of those different things. Give us the why behind why they should go out and get that vaccine. The coronavirus is a novel virus that really lacks uh, treatment options. So the vaccine is our one sure safe way to protect people from developing symptomatic COVID-19. 
It, it's a safe and effective vaccine. It's been tested uh, aggressively through the normal testing channels. Um, and it really has been shown to prevent symptomatic COVID-19. Both the Pfizer and Moderna vaccines are showing about a 95% efficacy in preventing symptomatic infection. And the Johnson & Johnson vaccine, while studied slightly differently, is roughly 65% effective at preventing symptomatic infection, um, but 100% effective at preventing hospitalization and death. And for a vaccine to have that level of efficacy is really incredible. That's awesome. And again, at resourceswellspan.org, or they can reach that hotline there, 855-851-3641 to get more information on how they can schedule an appointment and find the different locations to get vaccinated, correct? Absolutely. Right on. Stephanie, the co-lead in vaccination planning for Wellspan. Thank you for your service to this area um, and, you know, getting things back to a, I hate to use the word back to or phrase back to normal, but getting us into a good spot here and finding that light there at the end of the tunnel. Thank you so much for your effort, Stephanie. Absolutely. It's been a, a strange year in healthcare, but I can tell you the ability to provide vaccine vaccines to our community has been some of the most rewarding work we've engaged in.